Hey guys, so today I'm going to film a very exciting video, which is a makeup challenge. It's the makeup look under five pounds and under thing. I did go over budget with one thing, which is actually a sponge, which is just six quid, but it blends up anything on your face, so it's so amazing. So I've already done my foundation concealer because something went wrong with the video, when I've already done my foundation concealer, so... Yeah, I'm just going to kind of do this makeup look for you, and I actually haven't put the makeup on yet, but yeah. Without further ado, let's get on the video. These are kind of products I use every day, so... So, first thing I got did, I'm just going to apply was apply this Avon foundation I'm just gonna apply a teeny bit more just to show you how I applied it and everything so I just put this on my cheeks or anything so I, this is really hard for me to like film for you guys so <laughs> yeah I basically just put it on my cheeks and my nose and everything so just my face looks a bit different just basically I already put the foundation on so I'm not gonna put them. then I use this LA girl and this was three pounds um, I got it for three pounds but it is usually three pounds seventy five but it is definitely under five pounds. And I love it, it's so cool. And it's in the shade Near Nude, which is kind of an orangey, it's my different shade that I'd usually get. Because this is for the summertime, my skin usually gets a bit more tanned, so I like to go for a darker foundation. So this is actually a shade too dark for me, because the one is called Ivory. And the one is Ivory, and I'm usually Ivory, but now I'm Near Nude. So this is the LA Girl Pro Conceal High Definition Concealer. I love this, it's so brightening and this is really hard to get product out of. So I basically I just apply it under my eyes. Like this and just down the bridge of my nose, like on my forehead and stuff. Because I actually lost my Avon stick concealer, I have no idea what's one. So this is £2.50 guys. I love this concealer so much. And by the way, guys, I have um next week I might do I don't know what video I'm going to film next week. If you have any video suggestions, so comment down below. I'm not doing... I might do an everyday makeup routine, but I do do different makeup, but I basically have one routine that I have to do all the time. And I'm also going to do my makeup collection uh, in four video, <laughs> like four videos time, so. Because, I mean, this is my fifth video, so I'm going to try and film that for my ninth video. Because I'm going on holiday the week after that, so obviously I can't film a video. That's, uh, that's going to be a Saturday video for me, for you guys. Because it's going to be what I was in my suitcase, so I've got to film it the week before. So, when I'm happy with my makeup collection, because I am planning on to get a couple of more makeup products. Before then, I need to get some to new storage. And a couple more makeup products from Pound World and a new foundation because like this is the only foundation that i have it's nearly run out so i can't take it on holiday with me this is my travel makeup bag so got that and so that's it all just basically done so then i'm going to apply my bronzer i'm going to use the collection bronze glow mosaic bronzer it's broke last week but i purchased it yesterday we purchased it yesterday and i absolutely love this and it's so cool it's in the shade two radiant my other one was in one two one sun kissed so yeah i'm just going to apply this with my favorite brush of one of my fa <laughs> one of my favorite brushes of all time it's this um like it used to be a big fluffy powder brush, but I flattened it out so I could use it for bronzer and highlighter. This bronzer is actually three pounds, and it's so great. It gives you such a bronze look. It's really sun kissed, and it's so super shimmery. It's like a shimmer powder. It's not really bronze, but it is bronzer, but it isn't because it's really shimmery and it's really pretty. And I'm just gonna put some under my neck. And basically just down the bridge of my nose. Oh, that's very bad. So then I'm going to do my blush. I'm actually going to use two products which are again under budget. So the next thing, first thing I'm going to use is this Revolution. This is from Poundland guys. It was in a set so. This Revolution blush. This is in the shade now. I really want to get the shade Wow which is a bit more of a warm tone shade this is a bit cool toned for me so i'm just going to just swatch this for you guys this the lighting's bad it's this really pretty pink blusher for a pound these are amazing so i'm just going to apply it with this blusher brush which i got from home bargain no b and bargains you really don't need a lot of these blushes as they're so painted i just used about two dabs to get the whole of my cheeks I'm 
and they're just so pigmented like I know I look good but I burned out as well so just going to blend this out a bit more I'm just going to kind of dab it a bit so it's really really cool and then I'm just going to set that with this W7 thing it's called blush with me it's like a blush so it's really natural warm tone shape so I'm just going to put this over so it's a bit more natural because you can see you can see it really doesn't do anything but it just kind of gives a nice rosy look and I really like this you also get like a contour brush which I have no idea which is in here because this is basically blushes and highlighters so this is actually not what I'm going to use for my highlight because I have such an affordable grey highlighter so the next product that I'm going to use is my favourite, one of my favourite makeup products of all time. It's the MUA Undress Your Skin Shimmer Highlighter. I have this in the shade Pink Shimmer. I've had this for about six months. I bought this in February, early February, now it's early July. So I've had this for absolutely ages and I absolutely love it. I've hit pan of it, which is so fine. But the reason why I love this is because it's so pigmented it proves that you really don't need to spend tons and tons of money on like benefit high beam or something this is just so beautiful three swipes of my finger you've got full highlight pigment i absolutely love this the lid is actually broke off but what do you expect i've had it for like six months so. i really really love this it's so pretty so I'm just going to apply this using the same brush that I applied my bronzer with because I like to use like a strong highlight so it's just so amazing I use like the same part of it all the time so I'm just applying this to my cheekbones it's just so pigmented and just a bit on my nose I need to blend it out on my nose a bit more and then just on my forehead as well to give me that really nice glow absolutely love this it's so pigmented there's like one gold one which my sister has but she doesn't like it and there's one called amber one which i never wear but this one's the most wearable shade and i'm so glad i picked this up I to my sister i was like should i get this and she was just like you could get it so just like um yes i'm getting this this is my first ever highlighter it's definitely going to be my favorite i've also heard really good things about the revolution highlighter which is the vivid baked highlighter and i might get that but this one is just my favorite the time for the time being and i just love it as i've hit pan and this is just probably going to last me till the end of the year because it's just so amazing so i've done all my face so now i'm going to do my eyes the palette that i'm going to be using for shadow actually i've got something in my little eye makeup Um, first I'm going to prime my eyes using the Makeup Academy Pro Base Eye Primer. I have no idea how much this was, but someone gave it to me. I think it's £3, but I know, definitely know this would be under £5. Because most of the promo things are like under £3. I'm pretty sure it's in the store. Again, I'll put these link down below. I won't put the shops because you can get these in natural drugstores, basically. Um, so, I'll put all the products. You're just gonna blend that with your finger. This is so good, and I think it has glycerin on it. Yeah, it has this glycerin on it. Or that glycerin. No, glycerin. It has glycerin on it, which means it sticks to your makeup. So, let me just check this out. I have a primer that I have, so yes, that's got glycerin. Why don't I just have the. You should have the ingredients in it. This is another ingredient in it. This is quite juicy. So I'm going to prime my eyes. The eyeshadow that I'm going to use today is the Revolution Iconic. If you're thinking like that's six quid. Four pounds for 12 highly pigmented eyeshadows i'm going to do a really pretty eye look which i've worn a couple of times um it's such a great palette this is a dupe for the naked three these are urban decay eyeshadow quality eyeshadows these are just so pigmented and so nice plus you get way more eyeshadow than you do in this palette than you do in the um 
you get many more products than you do in this one as you get in the other case. So this is just amazing. I definitely recommend you get one of the um, Urban Make Revolution palettes because ever it's on over six pounds, they're just really good quality. And trust me, you'll love them. First, when you use them, you think that's not pigmented when you swatch them. But you have to put your finger in a couple of times to get full pigmentation. And you have to kind of use them. I've used these about three times and I absolutely love them. So I'm going to use my everyday eye brush, which I think is behind my tablet. Oh, yes, it is. And I'm just going to take this really pretty golden shade. And I'm just going to, need to get my, my, my brush. Tap off the excess. Just apply this all over my eye. It's so pretty. So I'm going to do the same on the other eye. It's like really pretty. I'm just going to do the like two layers because that's what I always do. Get full impact colour. Then I'm just going to take this colour here, which I'm going to put this on my crease. It's really because it has a bit of black eye colour for my scratch. This is just so amazing. So then I'm going to take this really pretty pearlescent pink and just pop it into the inner corners of my eyelids. It's just so flawless. I really love this palette. So then I'm going to apply mascara. This is another thing from Revolution. It's the Awesome Lash Power and Definition Mascara. I really, really like this. It's a fill on big chunky mascara. Three pearls. Big and volumizing. It's so big i love the one because it's not fake and plastic it's real so it's like does the job i'm going to use this clear mascara which i got from the magazine the magazine is under four pounds so obviously this is under four pounds i'm just going to apply this onto my eyebrows because i don't have an actual eyebrow gel so i just use this clear mascara which i know a couple of people do so i'm going to get like the rimmel brow gel but i just use this every like freaking day so uh. Just going to kind of give a bit of a volume to my eyebrows. So now I'm going to do my lips. So I'm going to use two of my favourite products in the world. First one is the Primark Matte Lip Crown in the shade Nude. This is a really pretty chubby crown. I'm just going to apply this all over my lips. Then I'm going to use this is two quid. It's like an orangey. Pinky toned nude. So I can't talk like this one for minutes gone. It's so pigmented. And another one fuchsia, but I'm not gonna use that gel today. And then use the Essence Exit Sail Long Lasting Lip Gloss in the shade nude. This is one pound eighty. So yeah, that's basically my full makeup look. This is so great and it proves that you don't have to spend tons and tons of money on makeup and you can get really affordable makeup in drugstores. Most drugstore products are under £10, so if you can afford that, give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below your favourite drugstore makeup product and your favourite high-end product. And if you know any dupes me that you want to try and video suggestions, don't forget to keep 
hit that big thumbs up button and subscribe. Bye guys!